I might stick the camera in during. I doubt it because not only that the like you know how your helmet will sit like this when you're looking forward. I have to tilt the helmet like this and then look back to get the camera forward. I was going to wait until I got to the trail and just record my uh, warm up, but I really like this stretch of the road. It's very relaxed, very easy going, and just gorgeous. Gorgeous! Oh yeah. Um, I guess I really actually felt pressured into doing this because over the last, jeez, I don't know, month, I started getting people subscribing to me endlessly and trying to tell them I haven't said anything. I haven't vlogged in a very, very, very long time. Memorial Day doesn't count. That was a spur of the moment uh, ordeal affair. And that was just something special. But I honestly haven't vlogged at all since like March, February, January, something. I don't know. Anyway, in that time, people kept subscribing to me. So now I was thinking, oh, you know, I'm starting to feel bad. I need to start putting stuff out. And just recently, I think last week, something like that, I passed 200 subscribers. First off, I don't know how that even happened. I have, what, 10 videos? And they're not even that good. I mean, I've, I've seen vlogs, you know, they're average people doing average things, right? Doing average things, riding average bikes, and they're honestly entertaining. Everything they say is hilarious. They actually have good locales. I mean, I mean, look at this place. I mean, shoot, who wants to ride in a desert? Oh my god, really? I mean, look, look at this terrible weather. Granted, it is like a buck nine, buck ten, but it actually feels really damn good. And I'm in full leather. Full leathers right now, and it feels good. Of course, that's the effect of evaporative cooling. And I'm actually trying something that I read in a, an email from Cycle Gear about you know, staying cool during the summer. And one of them was wearing a light, long, light, loose-fitting, long-sleeve shirt under perforated leather. And I thought that was crazy, but I thought I'd try it. And sure enough, it works very well. I'm actually cooler than I would have been in a t-shirt. Because the shirt soaks up your sweat and then the wind passing through the leathers keeps makes it cool cools down the sweat and that in turn chill oh is there any turn there no not yet why the hell would i want to turn there anyway yeah the long sleeve shirt actually keeps you much cooler than just a t-shirt it's great um, 
Oh anyway, yeah, I haven't been vlogging. Part of due to time, um, motivation, there's been none. I'm actually trying to sell the bike right now, which, I mean, I don't want to, but doing so gets me into a, a good financial position for the future. And after doing that, after I sell this bike to take care of what I need to take care of, I can go get another bike, no problem. It'll be perfectly fine. Like nothing ever happened. Like I was never without a bike. Um, so yeah, that'll give me an opportunity to get something newer. Preferably new. I mean, I'm having my first two bikes being used. I'm kind of done with used bikes for the most part. Where the hell was I going with this? Oh yeah, I wasn't vlogging. Uh, um, that's pretty much it. <laughs> why, why, why I wasn't vlogging at all. And people kept subscribing to me. And I'm sitting there going, damn it, dude. And then here I am, past 200 subscribers. No idea how. And that got me to the point where, you know what, I actually have to start doing something for the people who hit subscribe. Actually, I have to thank, thank, like 70 people. <laughs> I've been ignoring all my emails from YouTube. Just because I've been busy trying to take care of junk, junk and stuff. Where does this turn out? I need to turn out. I need to zip up my leather. Oh, lazy steering. Yeah, there it is. Here. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't ridden for myself in. Shoot. God, I have no idea. I haven't ridden for myself. March? No, May. It's gotta be May. I think it's May. But, anyway. I was gonna just vlog for the warm up lap, but I kinda need to pay attention to warming up. I might stick the camera in during. I doubt it because not only that the like you know how your helmet will sit like this when you're looking forward. I have to tilt the helmet like this and then look back to get the camera forward. And it's not it's not fun. It's not easy to steer. Um I never really did a proper walk around of my bike either. In April? March? March. Had to be March. Yeah, it was March. In March, I, uh, got myself a bit of, a bit of cash. Looked around online. Originally, I wanted a 636, just because they're pretty awesome. And I actually found a 2008 ZX6R. I actually mentioned it, and this is the one that I went to look at. I have since removed all of the stickers on it. I mean, I think I counted... The fuck was that? Oh. Oh shit, it's a B. I think I counted, like, counting the fact that there are doubles on each side. I took off 32 stickers? Motherfucker. Dude, seriously, you're cruising for a bruising, alright? 